How to make a custom faceplate for your Xbox 360. If you've looked for a new faceplate for your Xbox 360 and been disappointed with the selection, learn how to easily do your own custom job. You will need the original faceplate, a drop cloth, two colors of spray paint, a printout of an image, a sheet of acetate, painter's tape, a precision knife or scissors, bling, and industrial strength glue. Optional, acrylic paint, and a paintbrush. Read all directions and warnings on spray paint cans. Contents are flammable and hazardous if inhaled. Use in well-ventilated areas and keep out of reach of children. Step one, lay the faceplate on a drop cloth in a well-ventilated area. Spray the faceplate with your chosen background color and let it dry. Step two, print a copy of the image you would like to have on your faceplate and tape the acetate on top of it. This process will work best with an image that is one piece and can be painted in one solid color. Additional features can be hand-painted with acrylic paint if you prefer to have a detailed picture. Step 3. Cut out the areas of the image you want to have on your faceplate with a precision knife or scissors. The acetate will be used as a stencil. Step 4. Place the stencil on your faceplate and tightly tape into place. Step 5. Spray paint the cutout using the second paint color. Pull the stencil and tape off immediately, being careful not to smudge the newly painted image. Allow paint to dry. Step 6. Glue any additional bling to the faceplate. This could include metal spikes, rhinestones, beads, paper, fabric, plastic spiders, or stickers. Did you know? The first game console was the Magnavox Odyssey, released in 1972. 